misty morning. Good morning from Singapore. Uh, hang on a second. So I've been down this morning um, for a quick workout. Um, about 6.30, didn't sleep very well last night. Uh, smashed the workout and I'm now gonna consume my body weight in breakfast goods. Sounds good to me. Yeah. Breakfast was super busy. I didn't film, I didn't, none of that. By the way, uh, I've now got a microphone attached to this camera, so hopefully my voice should sound silky smooth. Um, if not, then maybe it was a waste of money, but I don't know, looks, I was gonna say it looks cool, but it looks a bit stupid. It looks a bit like I've just attached a penis to the top of my camera. So, I'm gonna go wandering around Singapore today with a penis camera. Um, no, but breakfast was great, freaking amazing. I was super, super full. We're doing shift work today on the uh, on the breakfast. I went down, had like a nice 30, 45 minutes to myself, just chilled out. No, no Ina, no baby, no nothing. Malia, by the way, is just chilling in the background over here. We're staying, by the way, we're staying at the Park Royal uh, Hotel in Singapore, Park Royal and Pickering it's called, and it's friggin' beautiful, like really, really nice. They've got all these tons of green space outside, running all around the building. There's a garden upstairs in the, by the pool and everything like that. Really, really beautiful hotel. So we're all breakfast up. Ina is now finishing up her breakfast. She's gonna come up. Then we're gonna go for a little walk around in Chinatown, I think, have a stroll. You know, just go and get lost. Hopefully, Malia's gonna allow us to have somewhat of a half decent day. She's pretty good, so we'll see how it goes. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Yeah, okay, let's go out. By the way, uh, travel tip for any traveling parents or anything like that out there. The one thing that I would say, mm, all right, maybe not the one thing, but one of the main things that I would say to always take away with you, Ziploc bags. I carry around like a big pack of Ziploc bags with me because they're just freaking amazing for everything. Um, when you've got to put bottles and shit in bags and you don't want it to spill everywhere. And equally, it's essentially what I've done here is I've got this big bag here and it's a makeshift sterilizer bag. Um, you can buy the sterilizing bags, but these ones you can use for a ton of different things. Um, so you can fit three bottles in there, chuck a couple of sterilizing tablets in, you're done. And you can get like, I'll use one bag for about four days. So it's not like I'm just using a bag and throwing it away, just wasting plastic. One bag will last a while until it splits basically. So yeah, top tip. Hi right, babe, so what do you think of the, um, the new vlog setup, do you think? Is it? <laughs> it's a bit ridiculous. Does it look a bit ridiculous? You look, uh, you look like an important person. I am an important person. Yeah? Clearly, yeah. I also picked up one more thing uh, yesterday from here. So I've got the whole kind of setup going on <laughs> right now. Because why not? Like, I'd rather have too much stuff that I can take off than not have enough stuff. So I'm going to start with everything and then reduce accordingly. I think that's a good plan. So in case anybody was wondering, traveling with a child, although it's not actually that difficult generally, like she's pretty chilled. Um, things just take fucking long. Like it is now 11.30 and we haven't left the hotel yet. We're now kind of like trying to coordinate not only her stuff in a bag, but also our stuff. We've got this camera, Ina's got her camera that she videos stuff on. Plus we've got the DSLR that we take photos on, phones and all that jazz. Um, yeah, stuff just takes a long time to get going. So we're gonna go now and we're going into Chinatown. I haven't planned much other than potentially where we're actually going to go, which is gonna be Chinatown. And then we're gonna check out an area called Chiang Baru. Um, which is supposed to have some cool cafes and, and shit like that. So we're gonna go and check it out. She's just been fed. We've got one bottle with us. 
to take on the road, which gives us approximately four hours. Yes, you also have to plan that kind of shit when you're traveling with the baby as well. Um, but yeah, let's see how it goes. And look at this friggin' hottie that I'm with right here. I am not worthy. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Seemed like such a good idea, like such a nice moment between mother and daughter until she slapped the hot end of it. <laughs> so Ina's getting ready to bake us something today. What are you baking in the kitchen? Uh, nice outfit, babe. So today I'm wearing uh, Louis Vuitton uh, scarf. Louis Vuitton. Um, it's it's a new uh, menswear. <laughs> Chic. Um. Are you sure? Oh. All right, temple done. Uh, we're now heading to the MRT station in Chinatown. Uh, we're going to do it's just a couple of stops to an area called Tiong Baru where we're going to go and hook up with some nice funky cafes, apparently, according to Google. So let's see if Google tells the truth all the time. Ina has found an ice cream vending machine. No, it's not. What is it? You have to pick it yourself. Huh? All right, I understand this. So it's basically a grabber machine. See these ones that you have in the amusement arcades where you have to grab toys, except you're not playing for toys, you're playing for ice creams. All right, I like the sound of this. I'm up for a challenge. All right, so I'm going to try and win us. Uh, what do you want, babe? Do you want one of these ones, uh, I want this crunchy one. looking ones? I want this one. You want one of those? Yeah, I want the chocolate one if you can. But if not, one. just don't get the green one. But not the box, not the one, not the one that looks like a Rocky or whatever it is in there. You see that crunchy looking one? Yeah, that one's fine. So anything like that. Right, yeah. Let's, let's assess. All right, let's see how this goes. All right. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Are you gonna disappoint us? Probably. I've never won a toy in one of these machines before. <laughs> so. All right. So. Let's do this. Yeah. Oh, you got change. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> Are you ready? You playing? <laughs> All right. Here we go. All right. Fail. That is an epic fail right there. Oh, babe! It's just one try. One go. Is that it? Yeah. Okay. There. All right. Let's Come see on. This. Come on. No, it's a fail. No, wait, oh. <gasps> yeah. Wait, it's not done yet. <laughs> uh, ah. yeah. <laughs> but I got me a chocolate, chocolate pie. pie with vanilla ice cream. Awesome. We're doing crunch. You're doing crunch? Well, of course I didn't crunch, it's ice cream. It's not that nice. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Like Bring this up here a second. I just want to make a point to say you didn't just almost lose your life, but I do have this image in my head of your dress 
getting caught in the side of the escalator and just going like completely just ripping off and then you being Don't stood at the bottom the of the escalator okay. completely naked. Mm-hmm. Probably wouldn't be, but I'd give you my top. Okay, thank you. So we're here now uh, at Tiong Baru Station. Uh, just spoken to someone. Apparently, apparently it's one of those situations where the name of a station doesn't necessarily mean the name of a place. So we're actually about 10 minutes away from where all the cafes and things are. We found the area we were looking for. Um, it's just not really that much going on, to be honest. There's probably like six cafes and restaurants in a in a little area. They're all really small and really rammed because it's Sunday, Easter Sunday. I don't know whether Easter's a thing here, but um, yeah, they're really busy. So we're trying to find somewhere with some space (sighs) and I'm in desperate need of food, water and caffeine. All right, we finally found somewhere that wasn't completely packed to the rafters. It's called Flock Cafe. Um, The jury's out, basically I'll eat it. And then I'll decide where those go. Don't let this empty plate fool you. The uh, the food was... Hard. (laughs) (laughs) I'll give them like a... One? I'll give them a four, just because... um, Just because the eggs were seasoned well. So we're home, it's like five o'clock now, I think, and we had some chill time, and now we need to go and check out the swimming pool, don't we? Don't we? Can you show us Malia's outfit? Malia is wearing an outfit from the 1800s. Um, No, I'm joking. This is Malia's little outfit. These underneath here, for anyone that doesn't know, this is so that if she shits herself, it doesn't come out into the pool. See? Like sticks around there. Mm-hmm. So we're going swimming now. Let's go. <laughs> Just let us in. 